guys, welcome back to my channel or welcome if this is your first time seeing one of my videos. Thank you so much for joining me for this part of the Dream Home Decorator Let's Play. This is going to be a very exciting part because Joel and Dahlia are going to be getting married and Joel did go out for a little bit of a jog this morning. He is a little nervous just because it is the big day finally. He wants to be friendly to Dahlia and Dahlia is still sleeping and then I do have Leah over to kind of help make sure the wedding goes well. So I'm going to get Leah up. She's kind of tense too. I think she might be a little overwhelmed as well with the wedding, but she's gonna get up and get some breakfast going. I also wanna say sorry real quick, I'm having some allergies and so I might sound a little different in this video. Um, I'm sorry about that if I sound a little rough. But yeah, Leah's gonna get up and make a little bit of breakfast just so they're not too hungry for the day. Dahlia's sleeping in a bit, but I do wanna get her up as well. I'll probably have her take a steamy shower just because it is gonna be a very romantic day since she's getting married. But yes, I'm so excited to finally get them married. If you wanna see a little bit of like behind the scenes for the planning of the wedding, I'll link that video. I did do a little video on how I kind of plan weddings. Yeah, he's looking kind of bored, which isn't a good thing to be feeling on your wedding day, um, but he does need to come in. We'll get him kind of ready for breakfast. Dahlia's coming downstairs as well. Everyone is tense and bored, oh my gosh. <laughs> this is probably not a good start, but hopefully things will turn around. I'm gonna have Joel come in and be a little romantic to Dahlia so they can kind of, you know, get out the nerves of their wedding day. Maybe give her a loving hug and try to get them in a better mood. Oh my gosh, Dahlia wants to woohoo with Joel, that's so funny. So I thought it'd be fun to invite the bridesmaids and the groomsmen over and they can all kind of get ready here since they are getting married right next door they can just walk over and it can be really easy and convenient oh, so here's the family coming in we've got Blair and Ariel the two bridesmaids and then Joel's buddies should be coming in as well oh my gosh so this space is actually perfect for this ping pong table that they had in storage so I think I'll have the guys come over and just play some ping pong and they'll kind of bro out in there and then the ladies can come upstairs and relax in here. Maybe have some music playing and just kind of get ready for the wedding. Okay, so the boys are playing their game and Dolly is upstairs with the girls chatting. She's still tense, but she's more tense about work because she's had to take some time off to plan the wedding. So that's been stressful for her, but hopefully these girls can kind of make her feel better. Um, I know she really gets along with Ariel because Ariel is an art teacher and she went to school to study art and she loves to paint. And then Dahlia is very creative and artistic as well. So yeah, they'll just kind of chat. Maybe she can talk about some of the latest trends with work. Maybe that'll make her feel a little bit better. The guys got dressed and they're gonna play another game. And then I think the girls will start getting dressed. Poor Dahlia is just so tense. I don't know what to do for her. Um, she's dancing all tensely. So we got them in their bridesmaids dresses and then we'll get Dahlia in her outfit as well. And then we'll pretty much head over soon because I want to make sure we get there in time. And that's right, before we head over, we do need to bring some food. So Leah and Dahlia stayed up late last night cooking for the wedding. So we've got some baked chocolate mousse, some sourdough loaf. We got a roast chicken, garden salad, and then a coconut cake, which did someone, okay, no one took a slice. I was worried there for a second. So they made it here to the bar. I want to show off kind of how I decorated um, we've got the wedding area over here and I decided to just have them get married here because I thought it was kind of realistic. It was a nice venue that they already had and they, you know, are just really proud of this bar. Joel is definitely proud of it. So, um, you know, they want to show it off and kind of promote it as well, I guess. And it's just a nice space to have it. So um, they've got a little sign in area over here with some engagement photos I took of them and they could add the presents there. And then this is kind of like the reception area so they've got some more pictures here which are so pretty um, I just took them around town around this neighborhood in the city and then we'll put some food and drinks over here I've got a dance floor of course and then over here is like a little photo booth for the guests to kind of take pictures I thought that was really sweet so we're gonna go ahead and hire a mixologist and a DJ and unfortunately we cannot throw a party here so what we're gonna do is just invite the Winchester family. It has the whole family, so we'll just invite them and then Joel can invite any extra friends or however. Um, but I think we're gonna go and start a gathering. <laughs> it's gonna get kind of wild with all the Sims, but I think it's gonna be a lot of fun. Okay, they're gonna get married. I added a few more benches because there's just so many Sims. <laughs> but hopefully this goes well. I'm trying to get them over here. Yay! 
Yay, they did it. Oh my gosh, everyone else is just already partying over here. <laughs> Yay, she's so happy just married. And Joel is very happy too. Oh, I'm so happy for them. We definitely need to probably get some food for everybody. I did go and move the table out here so they can eat. And Leah's gonna come fill with some sparkling punch or fruit punch. And we've got some of the family dancing with the DJ. Percy might have wrote in the book and added a present. And yeah, we'll get them all dancing soon. I wanted to try to get them to eat, but I don't see many of them. I mean, I guess some of them have grabbed something to eat. We also have some random people here, which I keep trying to get them to go away. <laughs> but it looks like they're having a pretty good time. It's like beautiful here with the sun setting in the city. And the mixologist got here, so maybe Joel will order something to drink. Probably with his guys, so they'll get we'll get them to have some barley bale. And then Dahlia is finishing up her dinner. Dahlia and Ariel are dancing right here, so cute. I'll try to get them to come over though and dance on the dance floor. <laughs> but I think Dahlia is having a good time. She looks so beautiful. I did actually give them another outfit that I think I'll have Joel change into because it's getting a little late. He's had a few drinks and he's having a lot of fun. So we're gonna get him to change out of his jacket so he can, you know, show off his dance moves a little bit better. And then Dahlia will probably take off her veil as well, just so she doesn't get it dirty. And there we go. So yeah, we'll have everyone try to come over and dance together. Joel will drink with his buds. I don't know where they went, but <laughs> Aww, they're all having fun on the dance floor. Joel needs to come over and show off his moves too. So maybe he'll do a group dance with uh, his guys. Oh my gosh, Finn and Joel just hugged. That was so sweet. So Dahlia got a drink to fulfill her wish. Oh gosh, all the food went bad. <laughs> um, I'm trying to have Joel do a little bit of a dance battle because I couldn't get the group dance to work, unfortunately. But it looks like everyone's having fun. Oh my gosh, everyone's over here just chatting. It's always fun to have reasons to get everyone together. Okay, we finally got a group dance. Oh my gosh, that took forever. <laughs> I definitely wanted to do a different dance, but this is the one they're gonna do, so I think it's hilarious. Oh no, Darian messed up. Oh my gosh, performing a group dance, feeling happy for a successful group dance. That was hilarious. No one watched though, but I'm sure they practiced a lot for that. <laughs> But yeah, everyone's in here having an awesome time. They're all just chatting. They always love a reason to get together and celebrate. Aw, here's Niall and Jude sitting over here and chatting. So sweet. But I think it's late enough. It's almost 2 in the morning and Dahlia is exhausted. She has a good sentiment though with Joel. Oh my gosh. Deeply in love. That's so sweet. But yeah, I think it is getting late enough. So we'll go ahead and close out the groups. We'll end with the bridesmaids and the Winchester family and then the groomsmen. And I guess we'll head on home. Joel and Dahlia's wedding is over. Joel and Dahlia's wedding was pretty good. Leah got to do a lot of things she wanted to do, but not everything. Aw, probably because she was so busy helping out. And they both had a wonderful wedding, very successful. All the guests had a wonderful time. Uh, but yeah, we're gonna have them head home and spend their night together. Dahlia definitely has a wish here that I'll let them complete. I do think I'll send Leah home though before they head home, just because it's their wedding night. But let's go ahead and do that. So the newlyweds made it home. They just walked across the little way there. And they're going to go ahead and spend their night together. We'll have them woohoo. And I did bring over the presents. So they'll open those in the morning and see what they got. I'm so happy their wedding went well. Oh my gosh, that was so fun. <laughs> Um, yeah, and we'll get to see what is next for these guys if they are gonna have kids or however I really enjoy this let's play and oh my gosh. I love that they're both going up separate stairs <laughs> But anyway, thank you guys so much for watching and I will see you all very very soon. Bye